think I'm never going to be shit, don't you? Don't lie to me, Kelly. I can see it in your eyes. Ever since I lost the pizzeria, you stopped believing in me. I can feel it in your touch. I can feel it when I'm inside you. You know, maybe I have lost a step or two. Am I not allowed to mourn the death of my father in an Italian family? Do you know what that means? That means it's up to me to provide now. I'm gonna tell you something, Kelly. And uh, nobody is gonna know this. I burned down the pizzeria for the insurance money. But they figured out it was arson, and I ain't never gonna see that money. Seen. Um, first of all, good stuff. Um, really good stuff. Yeah, some of the best stuff I've seen from you. Thank you. Yeah, no, I worked really hard on this. Um, I only ate Italian food for this whole week because uh, I felt like that's what this character, Reno, would do. Sure, and you know what? Yes, whatever you think would get that character ready or get you ready to portray that, tell that story, that's what you've got to do. And the set, great, great, really paints a picture. That's good stuff and bold choices, right, everybody? I mean, you yeah. caught that, right? Yeah, I am starving. You want to go to you want to have Don't tender greens. What? If you order the right thing, it's really good. It's just greasy root vegetables. No, it's very healthy, and I'm trying to eat healthy, man. Today's my cheat day. I want Mexican. Can we have Mexican? No. I'm trying to eat healthy. Um, is this yours? It's Thomas's. Uh, I'll see you at Tinder Greens. Good job on your scene, Gabe. <clears throat> Thank you. So this is yours? I mean, I, th I think it is. Gabe is an acting turd? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I was just being stupid. I was trying to make Nick laugh. I'm just being, you know, dumb. This is what you think about my acting? I think that you need to, to like maybe challenge yourself a little bit more. <clears throat> well, that's why I did this scene. I'm not even Italian. All right. I'm sorry. Thomas? Yes. Uh, can I talk to you for a second? Uh, did you write this? I did. Sorry. It's inappropriate. This is, it's terrible. I know. I know. I pro okay, here's the deal. We have a zero tolerance policy for this kind of behavior. I understand. So, unfortunately, I I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Like, a permanent? I've been in this class forever. Are you, are you kicking me out of class? Look, unfortunately, I mean, this is kind of where we're at. Because at the end of the day, my job, I can't let you hinder another actor's career. You, you, you know, you're not do, doing him any favors by telling him he has a career. What'd you say? It's like near impossible to be a working actor. Almost, almost nobody has a career. So with the, the, that stat they always say, like one, one in five SAG actors, he, he works at all. I'm not in SAG. He's not even one of the possible five. We all start out not in SAG, okay? Before then, what do we do? We hone our skills, we build, we work our craft. That's you. You're really good. Thank you. And yet, you still have to teach here to make ends meet. That's not exactly true. I actually do this because I enjoy doing it. I want to give back. I like watching actors start in one spot and then go. Uh, uh, okay. 
So you mean to tell me that if you're Brian Cranston, after like 12, 13 hour day on Breaking Bad, you're gonna get off work, you're gonna, you're gonna come down here and you're gonna teach because you like giving back. Is he doing that? Because I actually need a class now. So do you know where, where Brian Cranston's studios is? Oh, you're a real fucking asshole, no, man. I'm not an asshole. No, I'm not. This, this isn't for him. He's good at other stuff. Like, the, the set looks great. Like, the, the costume, it's like, on point. Like, why are you trying to tell him to be a set designer? I'll tell you why. Because you want his money. Your problem? Your problem is your shitty attitude. Your shitty attitude is the reason you're not gonna go far as an actor, okay? I've seen so many fucking actors like you that come out here with a little bit of talent, they get a little bit of work early on and they just fucking think it's all up from there and they're negative. And you know what? Nobody wants to work with that fucking guy. Like you're a teacher, you're not supposed to say that stuff to people. Oh, well, I, I thought you wanted me to be more honest. Like we weren't even talking about me. Like we were talking about him. Guys, why don't we take a, a step back? Things are getting a little heated. Um, why don't we just take a little break before we say anything that we can't take back? Man, he can't even act in real life. If I'm not gonna make it, he's definitely not gonna make it. If, if they were, if they were shooting this scene right now, they'd have to re recast it because he can't, he can't do it. Like I'm saying terrible stuff about him. If the, the camera were like the cut to him, the audience would have no idea what emotions were happening. They have to put a voiceover in there. Problem is, it's, it's his voice. He's a dummy. Shut up! performance, that'd be good stuff. <laughs> <laughs>